Hi everybody and welcome back to this lesson. In this lesson we're gonna be talking about 10 words in English and we will try to correct their pronunciation in addition to give an example for each other. Let's start. Jasmine 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 it's a type of flower its color is white and we can use it to extract perfume from it let's take an example I love the smell of jasmine I love the smell of jasmine perfume I love the smell of jasmine perfume next word absolutely 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 all of native english love this word and use it usually it's mean that you sure 100 person and you are want these things 100 person for example do you want a coffee yes absolutely let's do it next word perfume 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 is a liquid we obtain it from different type of flowers let's do an example which smell of perfume do you love which smell of perfume do you love i love the smell of jasmine flower next word probably 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 this word give the person who listen to you that you not sure 100 percent you sure maybe 50 50 you are not sure exactly for example probably i'm gonna travel out next year that's mean you are not sure 100 percent you will travel out next year next word modify 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 in the job or in the work when you talk to your boss or your manager about something your manager or you shouldn't use you should change your behavior or you should change your way in the work uh, for more professional and for more suitable you can use this word modify for example finally you passed our exam certainly you modified your studying way finally you passed our exam certainly you modified your studying way next word complication 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 this word we use it to talk in a job with our manager uh, about a problem in our work it's more professional and more suitable to use complication instead of problem because when you say to your manager there is a problem uh, he will have a, a nervous nervous feeling let's do an example there is a problem with my project your manager mm. but when you say there is a complication with my project your manager will have a feeling so so he will say to you uh, what's the problem what's this 
What's wrong? It's more suitable. Complication, more suitable than problem. Next word. Elaborate. 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 We can use it when you talk with your manager or your boss in a meeting and uh, when you don't understand what he wants or what he means, what he wants or what he means. Instead, the, instead of what do you mean, you can use for more professional and more suitable words, you can use elaborate. Let's take an example. There is some vagueness. Could you elaborate? There is some vagueness. Could you elaborate? There is some vagueness. Could you elaborate? Don't use what you mean when you are in a meeting. <coughs> Next word. Vagueness. 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 This word, we use it when we have a plurring some things or with one side or two side in a issue. For example, I don't understand what you said. Something looks vagueness. I don't understand what you say. I don't understand what you said. Something looks vagueness. I don't understand what you said. Something looks vagueness. Okay, vagueness equal to plurring. Next word. Straightforward. 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 This word, we can use it instead of easy when we are in a work, in a job, when we talk with our manager. And let's do an example in two sentences and compare the difference the difference meaning between them this project is really straight for word this project is really straight for word the second sentence this project is really easy in the first your manager will have a feeling that you are a responsible person but in the second sentence your project will be not sure that you are a responsible person last word honestly 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 mean when you use it you want to make sure for all person or for uh, or for the person who talk to you that you want from him to believe you and you are honestly 100 percent let's do an example i can honestly say i tried my best i can honestly say i tried my best in this sentence, when you ask someone about his exam, what did he do in his exam, when he satisfied about himself, he will say, I can honestly say I tried my best. So he will not blame himself if he fell in the exam. That's everything today. Thank you for watching. See you in next videos and goodbye.